I gotta say, this music just makes me think of the House of Mouse song. <laughs> Oh, booster is magic. Oh no. So yeah, this is a little hide and seek mini game. If you fail, you have to fight booster. And you know what? I think I'm gonna fail. I guess for the sake of EXP. <laughs> I don't know, he's probably like super hard and I shouldn't fight him. See the Mario doll above the curtains. Alright, so I'm just gonna let myself get caught here. Although, you, you do have like multiple chances. Check it out by attacking Mallow. Wow, you got a lot of first turns. Screw you. <laughs> Start with a uh, good AoE attack. I'm not sure, really sure what that does. So we can attack Booster right now. Okay. Alright, well that was... I gotta judge the timing for that now, but it seems like uh, it's easy to work out. Glad I gave you that magic defense, Mallow. Oh, it failed that. Failed that, but I've still got him. Alright, now I get to fight the warrior knockoff himself. Got to re-heal up. <laughs> yeah, so Mallow can heal me, thank you. Mallow should heal himself too. Still hard to do though. Oh, okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, we should try a super move. I totally forgot. Let's try shooting Star Shot. <laughs> that was just like in Paper Mario, the shooting star attack. Oh, that's really... Wow, that is good. That is, like, really good. so bad. More EXP for the win. I'm not sure. Probably we get a better reward for doing that mini game, but whatever. More EXP. Oh, nice! It's oh my username's the password. So good, and it's even better because Booster is in. One of my stories where Shreen Uno's the main character. Oh, that is so good! Oh, thank you for the fan service, Nintendo. So freaking good. And now we immediately have another mini boss. Wait, you took all the trouble to come here. To stick around. Knife guy and great guy. Get it? Cause nice and great. <laughs> Alrighty. Now I was good at judging the timing for Bowser's attack, and now I'm not. See what super jump or super fireball can do. Oh, clearly nothing against him. Okay, it affects you at least. Let's try Super Fireball against the Knife Guy then. He's gonna use his knives to defend. Okay, you're weak to it! Mallow's the one who's... I forget... I can't forget who has what badge. <laughs> You're the one who's immune to sleep, right? I don't know anymore. Either way, we need your freaking AoE attack. Okay, well, he's weak to it. The other one's not. Alright, interesting. Unit's height, I was worried if I could pull that off. Even bear height, I should say. Alright, that was good. Alright, that was good. Alright, we cut one, we got rid of one, perfect. I gotta say though, like, for playing this on normal mode and not easy mode, this game already has so many changes that just make combat so much easier. No, we just found out that the Thunderbolt uh, can hurt you, so I should just keep using that. Even though you're probably about to die. Why not just expedite the process, huh? 
Yeah, easy fights. The more EXP, the better. Oh, now I got a mini game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Alright, let's do this. The B button's a jump button, got it. Yeah, probably a lawnmower. That is just not fair. So, we set up a, a giant Christmas tree at the White House. Yeah. And it was decorated. And the tree light ceremony is supposed to be tomorrow. Wind blew it over. <laughs> yep. It might be unusual. I shouldn't see how Michael Berry left. He's got four flowers now. Alright, looks like we're at the end. Okay, there's just no way to leave the map. Hmm. Okay, I want to backtrack back to Tadpole Place first. I, wanna, I just want to see like this thing is available right now. Okay, so he's here, so I should be able to do this. Actually, can I use one? Yeah, I should just use these, actually. Yeah. That would have been the first spot there. Hang on.
Oh, you stupid Joy-Con. What the frick is wrong with this thing? Oh my god. Wow, this is the worst. Okay. All right. Okay. Wow. God, I hate the Joy-Con drift. So. Is so bad. What you doing? <laughs> you want the funky? Are you done with a new game? Yeah. A new old game? Uh, it's a remake. A remake? Yeah. Oh. It's uh, it's a bad controller, but yeah, it's Super Mario RPG. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, special items. Okay. Oh, that lets you get access into places. Interesting. Alright, now we're... Oh, no, we gotta go to Toad Town. So I happen to know about another invisible block that I missed. A block that I missed. In the item shop, in fact. Yeah. Yep, you gotta use him for platforming, baby. Nice. Didn't even use any of these. Oh my god, I just had to click R and stuff to go to the other features. Sure, that sounds interesting. Mm -hmm. Say it does anything though. <laughs> fake, fake chomp. <laughs> well, that's not gonna happen then. <laughs> oh, I could have equipped it. Oh well.
sure. I'll just give all my party members some buffs. That's not fair. Okay, you can't like me up against him apparently. Okay. Mini game. I think you get a funnier cutscene the faster you beat it. Oh, oh, and that's good. In the original game, Peach's sprite doesn't lose her crown, but in this game, she does. So that's that's a good feature. I don't even remember if you could see the items in the original game. <laughs> well, Mario Wonder, they say that. Uh, the sea tastes like tears, so vice versa. <laughs> this is like the first time, uh... Oh yeah. Okay, so we have to find, like, the last thing. Alright, so we do need to actively find it. Maybe, like, it's up here or something. Oh, okay. That was a waste. <laughs> Alright. What 
funny cutscene do we get? <laughs> All right, I'm satisfied. Who is that? Huh? Who's, the, who's that guy who's riding? Uh, that's Booster. He's like a, a unique character for this game. Oh. He's like a hybrid between a human and a fuzzy. That's my head cannon. Huh. Oh, that is a that's a good looking cake. Let's eat it. Why why does Xavier have two heads? Indeed. Okay, so the chefs are the boss. That's odd. Dang it. There we are. Bugs. We gotta attack the cake, too. <coughs> are they gonna get power from the cake? Oh, I just can't do it anymore. Okay, that's new. Okay, uh... Cake is immune to lightning. Mallow is essentially useless in this fight. Can we light the candles? <laughs> Not at all! Wow, this is a good cake. Can we terrorize him? Can we terrorize a cake? No. What is this fight? Yeah, so what kind of ingredients did you put in this cake? Okay, it's like a split second after the third whoosh. It's got, like, at least two faces on it. I'm not sure which one's a true face. Tag with A to blow out the candles. Okay. So this is our chapter boss. Bunt. Definitely the most unique chapter boss. So that's why these A attacks were the only effective ones, because it's just how we bought the candle. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, I was gonna say, please only focus on Mallow. Alright, I just realized Shino has a new cannon, but it almost kind of works the same, and I got it right. Well, that's just not fair. Okay, please only attack Mallow. Ugh. Dang it. Also, you can't switch out Mario, so that makes this a little worse.
Oh, at the end. Oh, we gotta destroy the, the bottom face. So it does have two faces. Well, this is bad. So, use Raspberry. Can I use my other attacks now? We ought to wait. This is Booster's wedding cake. I'll have a fit if we nibble on it. Hey, number one, where's my cake? Booster, sir! There's any percent chance the object you're sitting on, what do you fee, is a cake. This thing's a cake! Okay, everyone, here's the supper. How do we eat this? I say we boil it. Number two, what do you say? Way too messy. Why don't you just swallow it? What? In one gulp? That's easier said than done. Come, Booster! You can do it! Open wide, please! My nerves are shot. Man, oh man! I feel like I've forgotten to time my cord before a bungee jump! Here it comes! Wait, wait! Did the cake just move? Concentrate, sir! This doesn't feel right! Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Hang on, I'm feeling a feeling. Yes, yes! It's so good, it makes me want to cry. Congratulations, sir. The wedding is now officially over. Yeah, it's not about marrying the bride, it's about eating the cake. <laughs> and that's pretty much the end of the booster arcs. Really, really fun character. Yeah, it's gonna be Bowser, twice. Well, you know, in Super Paper Mario, you know, that wedding actually was official, even though Peach was kind of brainwashed. I think in the original version, if you play this Oregon, it plays like a Chrono Trigger. Or maybe we have to come back later for that. Of course, they might play something else now. Chrono Trigger? I don't know who owns Chrono Trigger. So yeah, these two were like in Toad Town. So it's kind of foreshadowing this event. I think someone's scared over there. Oh, you know, is that a Tadovsky song? <laughs> no. Alright, we still don't really get the next one for a little bit. <laughs> What's this kid's problem? <laughs> Now the cake is a Mario flavor. Ho ho! Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> nice. So where's that green toad? I wonder if he's like hiding somewhere. Oh, it just automatically goes to Mushroom Kingdom. All right.
<laughs> Surprised Bowser went along with this. get like full party conversations like this in Paper Mario. I really hope they um they change that in the remake. <laughs> yeah, it really just sounds like the Star Road decides the course of all fate for the this freaking world. You no, know, maybe that's Smithy's goal. He just wants to... He just wants to break that broken rule, you know? So that... So that life can progress naturally without being decided by the power of wishes. It's kind of unfair if you think about it. Now we get her introductory cutscene, even though technically the beginning of the game was her, the fully animated cutscene for her. <laughs> oh, that's too cute. Bye, Peach. <laughs> Yay. Just about every playthrough I've seen, Mallow and Gino just get completely replaced by Bowser and Peach, because they're just the best party members. But that's I always found that really sad, because they're not unique characters. Just as I thought. <laughs> Yeah, it kind of see. We essentially get two party members in this chapter, but it also makes up for how Chapter Three didn't have any party members. So Bowser's like the Chapter Three edition, and Peach is the Chapter Four edition, pretty much. But we still don't have a star yet, so the chapter is not quite over. Cause there's. Where do we need to go, actually? Oh, we need to go to Temple Pond? That's why it has a flag over it? I guess we gotta talk to the Elder. Okay, that's this is what we have to do. Okay, that's pretty pretty basic. I don't go here first. Yeah, cause like. This whole booster stuff still takes place on the third world, where, um, we got the third star already. But now, we're gonna get the fourth star on the fourth world! It's kinda interesting how they mix up the formula like that. One of my- probably my favorite location in the game, Star Hill, is just gorgeous.
And they do look like the, uh, the, the stars, the star bits from Mario Galaxy. Yeah. Which came first? Obviously, well... Okay, I mean, that's the exit. Obviously this game came first, it was made in 96. Mar Mario Galaxy was 2007. I mean, the, these designs are still the same, basically. Did you ever play this back in the day? Nope, that's why, um, that's why I got it. In fact, this place was actually, um... It's this is actually the same place as Shooting Star Summit from Paper Mario. I think, I think like the wiki says it. So there's some continuity there. Oh look, we got a little wish thief. Oh, screw you. Let's just fight these enemies since they're unique. Echo, a second. Wow. Okay. One second. Oh, we got a world seal this time. Oh, you you look cute. You don't. It makes sense that that enemy would be there. It's basically a crystal star type of thing. Throw fur. <laughs> Rofer and Pulsar. Mallow died. You know, you should be really weak against the hammer attack. My baby's cute. <laughs> what are you gonna do if it's not? So yeah, if you talk to each of these face stars, you get to hear people's wishes. I really like that aspect. Wish I had some cricket jam. And yeah, you, you can find like all these people around the world. And so there's somewhere someone in the world wants some cricket jam, that might even be a side quest. Can't wait to start a family. See, there's a nice wish. But, oh, we can go back here. Oh, I guess who's here? I wish I weren't such a crybaby. <laughs> and that one's Mallow. <laughs> Ha ha ha. 